Okay, we just got a clear signal for an eastbound. To my knowledge, there are at least a couple of eastbounds on the way. Uh, V07 has just started to move again, release the brakes. I'm guessing maybe he didn't have the signal at Murray, so. <clears throat> but now he's on the move again, so. We'll go ahead and pan back over here. I'm guessing this is probably Amtrak 93 that's going to be coming east here. So 233 probably crossed over at Myrtle. But this is just guesswork. But it would make sense, obviously, because it is around the time that 93 would probably be running. <clears throat> I don't have my scanner on me at the moment. I left it back down at the station there, so I don't know how close the eastbound is. The train should be ending pretty shortly here. I believe Q135 already passed on the uh, Portsmouth sub going south, but he had the same power as the F763 that you saw earlier delivering the intermodal for said train at Kelby so we didn't really miss anything special. Yeah I see the cars going up across the crossing up there so this train's getting close to the end. The gates just went up up there so and I see a headlight cresting the hill up there it looks like. Yep, hey, look at that. 
Another eastbound. Here he is. So he's going to pass the V07 right here. Should be Amtrak. All right, it is 10.45 p.m. We have Another eastbound, this time coming on one. Amtrak 93. He just passed by the V07, which is headed on to the Commonwealth Railway. That was pretty cool. So we got 233 meeting the V07 and Amtrak 93 meeting the V07. And to my knowledge, there are at least two more eastbounds and two more westbounds out there as well so yeah pretty neat thanks for watching